Boy, they really got it right with the 67 Fastback, man. This is such a cool car. I love this body style. This color combination is so great. The gray with the, with the white stripe, black interior, the Magnum 500s on it. This car has got a splash of originality and a splash of a little custom to it from one year Mustang to another. I just love this car. But uh, anyways, I'm finalizing a few things for a car show we're putting it in. And one of the questions I get asked a whole lot on these cars is the arrangement of the heater hoses. Which hose goes where? You only got two of them, but does, which one goes on the top and which one goes on the bottom? Pretty good question to ask because it's got a lot to do with it. Let me show you what it's all about. The heater hose that's on the intake manifold of these cars is your outlet hose, meaning that's where the water is going to come out. It's going to run down the heater hose into the firewall to the lower section of the heater core itself. On the other side of the firewall, you got a whole heater box that has a heater core in it, and these heater hoses lead into an inlet, comes back out, and then leads to the outlet. The reason why they have the inlet on the bottom and the outlet on the top is so it can push out any type of a blockage of an air, air lock inside there. It also allows the warm water to kind of rise. As warm water, just like hot air rises, warm water will seek its, seek its height too. So this way the warm water will go in the bottom, push out any air, and then go through the top. Then from there, your upper, radiator, or upper uh, heater hose runs down the intake manifold and into the water pump itself. So the inlet is your water pump side, the outlet is your intake manifold side. If you also go to your shop manual, whether it's a Camaro or a Mustang or a Cooter, whatever you got, man, the shop manuals normally outline what's the inlet, what's the outline. They usually have little arrows on the, on the hoses to show you the flow of water so you know which goes where. It's a real important thing to do. And I tell you what, man, I just love working on this car. I wish this one was mine. If I'm putting together a 67 Fastback, this is the one I'm putting together. Let me finalize a few things and we'll move on from there.